if you are struggling on your youtube channel then these eight things i want to show to you is the only reason why you are not getting results after spending years on youtube and made a lot of money on youtube i really understand how these things work the number one problem is a wrong niche if you are in the wrong niche then chances are you are going to struggle with it and look at this when i say you're in a wrong niche it doesn't necessarily mean that that niche is not profitable what makes it wrong is the fact that you are uninterested in that niche. I've had people go into health niche because they think they can make something out of it. Or maybe because someone they respected advised them for it. And let me tell you, most people think, okay, I can do anything for money, especially when they are just starting out. After you get into the nitty gritty of things, then you realize that your passion, what you are interested in, is usually the driving force. You see people, they can no longer create content because nothing is moving them. Then they say they have burnout. You don't have burnout over what you love. It's only because you never really, really love this thing. The essence of your starting on that niche is because of money. And now you have gassed out. Either you have made a little or you have made none. When you love something, even if you are making nothing from it, you can continue. But you are not able to continue this. You are tired of it simply because there is no interest in it. So to reverse this, go into something you love. Even if it doesn't make sense to you, you are going to be shocked how much money you are going to make based on the passion you have. The gift of a man make it way for them. That is exactly what I want you to do. Number two problem that your channel is going to have is the fact that you are not making enough content. A lot of people when they start out, they want to behave like the big YouTubers and then you do one content per week, one content per month, you can't survive like that on YouTube. Everybody has a low span of watch. When people watch you today, they can't remember you again in the next three days. So you need to consistently rank yourself in their presence, put yourself in their faces till they know who you are. So while you are starting out every single day, Make sure you are busting out content. That's how to do it. You have to continue to do that until you know that you are growing organically on YouTube. Introduce yourself genuinely to YouTube. Let YouTube know who you are. Let it know what you are made for. Let the algorithm be your friend. Number three problem that every channel has is every single day, we are always engrossed with getting virality because we know virality is what makes our metrics count is what gives us money you see people looking for oh, i wish i can just have a million views that i know how much money it would have given me my friend if you seek virality you are going down and i'm telling you from experience and study of gazillions of channels when you go viral once it's always very sweet let me tell you my own experience in a day you post a video you are expecting to have 500 views and then boom 250,000 views. Do you know what that means? Instead of making maybe $5, you end up making $2,500. The same effort, the same channel, the same post, boom, everything is sweet. But you know what happens next? After then, you want that cycle to continue and it will never continue no matter who you are. So your views are coming back to 1,000 views. From that 250,000, you are coming back to 1,000 views, which is your normal channel rate. But then how do you feel after making $2,500 from one single video and then the next one you put is making $5, the next one, you can't last three months, you are going to be fully tired. It drains your energy because all of a sudden you have tasted the goodies, you can't go back to the trenches. That is why you should not look for virality. Just grow at your momentum. Let your money grow at the same level so you have the same motivation to keep creating content. Otherwise, that's the end of that channel. I hope you get this. And this is exactly what takes me to number four, which is not putting in the work. Look, when you have a channel, it's your gateway to wealth. I can tell you that for free. But when you do it like a side also, and you are not putting and investing your whole time into it, it's going to create more problem for you than you even estimated. Because now you've started a thing you can finish. Now you started a thing is not growing. Now you started a thing that you don't even know is going to add more of impact or success to you. It's a big problem because you are not putting in the work. How do you put in the work? By creating the best and best of content. You need to improve. If you are still in the same level you were last three months, there is a problem. If your set still remains the same with what you had one year ago, there is a problem because you are not evolving. And let me put it to you this way. 
the toothpaste you buy do you see that they change their brands you should ask yourself why are they changing the package of it why are they changing the container for maybe the biggest brands in the world coca-cola will change their content they will change their packaging they will change their can think about it why are they changing it why are they wasting money why are they wasting millions of dollars on these things if you're on the same level you're looking the same way you're wearing the same thing you are on the same set year in year out people watching you are going to be tired they want new things as soon as you change yourself you have new viewers and then you have a lot of people saying oh i like this new thing now oh i like that thing on the background if you use that for three months they're tired of it again you have to move it again that is how to be hard working and youtube will now repay you with this algorithm but if you're waiting for algorithm to bless you before you start moving no you have to show your hands first before youtube picks you up and the next one i'm saying which is my number five is incredible more than 98 percent of people do not see this about youtube channel it's a business it's not a hobby youtube channel is a business gone are those days you have tv stations ait for example in nigeria cnn for example you have them there what do you think they are doing they are creating content exactly the way you are doing how much do you think cnn is worth every movie production set what do you think they are doing they are creating the same thing you are creating look you are not going out anytime soon this is not a sprint it's a marathon you're going to do this till you're 90 years old i'm sure you've seen people who had been acting for 45 years of their lives you have just started the same thing my brother that is why you have to take your youtube channel as a business don't take it as a hobby i hope you understand this if you need more details about this i can help out with that just ask me from the comments and that's why you see people taking other people's contents trying to merge it together they have a youtube channel you don't have a youtube channel you can't take other people's products and think you're selling unless you are their affiliate so if what you are creating on youtube is to take other people's things that is not how to run it you need to produce your things with the mindset of a business if you have a product you have a service that is how you're going to be tailoring things that's the best way to run your youtube channel to success otherwise you are going to be tired just like you are without results which takes me to point number six which is you are not investing enough in this channel every business in the world if you agree this is a business you have to invest in it before it can start producing it's only on youtube you see people come onto youtube after three months they are complaining after one year they are complaining on the outside world without online you're going to be studying something for two three years if you want to be a vulcanizer for example that takes you years before you can even learn let alone now looking for freedom for nigeria you understand what i'm saying and then after that you now have to start hustling to get clients it's the same thing on youtube so give yourself the time set out your plan and understand what you are targeting and how long it will take you so you won't gas out and say you are burnt out how this is clear invest more into your channel buy new microphones if you are a lady wear makeup in your videos so you look nicer improve on your set all of these things put together is what you should be targeting and it will make a lot of sense as you will grow rapidly if you start implementing these things and now let me tell you my number eight will be the fact that you are depending on google adsense you know when you come on youtube you hear something like how to get 1000 subscribers how to get 4000 watch hour i just want to be monetized on youtube i've had some guys who had been monetized for the past three months they've not even made hundred dollars to tell you youtube adsense is just mega it's just something small compared to how much you can really make on youtube so if your job on youtube is to depend on google ads you're not going to make much because no matter the niche you are it's really little unless you're in some high cpm niches that's why it's important that when you start out you set up how to make money by the way there are like six different ways that makes more money than google adsense that is what you should be stepping out on and depending on not the google adsense so from the beginning of your channel either you're monetized or not either you have a thousand subscribers or not you should have been making money from this channel i'm sure you are thinking how is that even possible of course i've treated that and i would like to expose it to you look at this tutorial here click on it and learn it now let's go let's go let's go